so um i'm gonna expose this okay yo i know i'm a mess i just was laying down and then um someone just sent me a screenshot of something on youtube and let me tell you guys a secret here i had a really fight a big fight with my mom in 2019 and um we have since fixed our problem we have talked we you know um that fight was from an argument i had with my mom in 2019 the video was sent to natasha rakestraw also online known as Tashi Kins, known as Natasha Rick, uh, Zakarian, and known as Angelica Zakarian, also known as Natasha Angelica, and also known as Angelica Rickstra. She goes by a lot of usernames on social media. I used to live with this Natasha girl. And after she admitted to stealing $4,000 from me, $4,000 fucking dollars, dude, I was fucking homeless. In 2019. And she stole four fucking thousand dollars from me. So after I demanded that she give me my money back. And the doll collection back. She said no. I'm going to just keep it. And um, I told her that if she doesn't. I'm going to go to the police. And mm -hmm. I did. And I literally um, told them what went down. And they said you can get a lawyer. And you can sue her for the money. And I've been trying to do that. And then she sent the videos to my ex-friend. My stalker, who has been harassing me for three years. <laughs> yeah, she really thinks I'm a fucking stalker. Mm -hmm. She tells me all these horrible things on social media. And... Accusing me of doing things I've never done. She calls me the W word. She slut shames me. She blame she victim blames me for being raped and then turns around and says that I deserve getting raped. And then she put the video of me and my mom arguing last year up on YouTube. This is Coriander fucking Bullard. You fucking retard. Like, are you fucking kidding me? Why the fuck would you Harass my family like that. She claims that I'm the one harassing her family. She claims that I'm the one sexually harassing her husband. And she is the one who's doing these things to me. She claims she's a victim of bullying. She is the owner of the Reaper YouTube account. Coriander Bullard is the user the, behind the, the Reaper um, username on YouTube. And codename Sailor Earth, but we already know codename Sailor Earth. C N S E is the art plagiarist who got blacklisted in a few years ago for art theft and animation theft. Like, if you are supporting her and you are on my friends list, I hate you. You are a miserable, wretched person to support her hatred and rape and assault of me. Like, how bad does someone have to be? How miserable do you have to fucking be to accuse and hurt someone who's already been raped and then harass my fucking family? <laughs> like, you gotta be fucked up to want to do that to my mom. I don't know if it's because her dad hates her and she thinks her good father who did good for her got a new wife and a new family and she got jealous that he got moved on without her or maybe it's the fact that her mom can't keep her legs closed or I don't know maybe it's the abortion that her mom had but harassing my family because her family is fucked up does not make my family evil and yes my mom and I have worked things out and yes we have fixed our issues and yes we did have a fight, but that doesn't mean that we're not mother and daughter anymore. But the fact that she posted something so private and claimed that my family hates me because of that one thing, that one video, that is fucking disgusting. That is fucked up. And yes, this is going in a book. And yes, she will fucking regret it. She doesn't want people fucking writing a book about her. Well, now I have a fucking reason to. Harassing my fucking family. Like, that is so screwed up. That is so fucked up. 
You gotta be some kind of racist, stupid person to think that harassing my family would make me look evil and make you look like a hero. I don't even know what the fuck is wrong with this girl. Like, maybe she hates me because I'm smarter than her, or I'm prettier than her because it's pretty obvious I'm both. Or maybe it's the fact that I'm just more successful than her, but the fact that she harassed my family by posting a shit video from last year. To make me look bad. You know what that makes me look like? Like I had a fight with my mom, and we fixed our issue. You know, after 20 years, her dad still hates her. That does not change. Making shit about me and my family does not mean that her dad is going to walk back in her life and make her life great. She's still a failure as a daughter. FYI. My ex-friend is still a failure as a daughter. And for the record, because I'm her ex-friend, I'm going to tell you guys something. She's still a failure as a friend. She was a failure as a publisher. She was a failure as an editor. I don't even know how to fucking, like, I don't even know how to deal with this. Like, how do you, how do you justify assaulting someone's family? Like, how does that even work? How the fuck does this girl even have any followers? It's one thing to assault me on social media, but when you go after my mom and my family, that is so fucked up. And yes, my fucking family actually love me. When I became homeless, you know what my cousin said? Hey, Tracy, come to our house. You'll live with us. When I was homeless and my mom found out, she let me live with her. When my, my uncles found out th that I got homeless, they told me, you're going to come to live with us and we're going to help you. When my ex-friend ended up homeless, nobody fucking helped her. I think that's what pissed her off, is that she really, 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 really wants people to hate me. She really, 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 really wants my family to hate me. But they don't. Nobody fucking hates me. I'm not evil. And I'm not a thick villain. I'm not some, like, vindictive, evil, queen barrel bitch from her fantasy fairy tale. And no, she's not a fucking hero. She's a fucking rapist. I feel like I'm sexually assaulted. I feel like I'm raped all over again. Should I just call her a rapist from now on instead of a fucking racist? There is no reason to harass my family. There's no fucking reason for it. I don't even know why she would do this. Like, what the fuck would be wrong with you to do this to my mom? Just because my mom and I had one fight. One fight in a decade. That makes me evil. Posting that does not make me evil. And anyone who supports my ex-friends, you need to get the fuck out of the book community. You don't belong here. You don't fucking belong being a writer. You don't belong being a blogger. You don't belong being a doll collector. You are fucked up to think that you would need supporters. Like, this is what my friend, ex-friend has done to me. She ruined... She posted a piece of video clip that I sent to her. When I was fucking trusting her. And she exposed that my mom and I got into a fight. And she claims that because we had a fight last year. That... That my family fucking hates me now. They don't fucking hate me. Nobody fucking hates me. I'm not evil. I will say I'm prettier than my ex-friend. I'm smarter than her. I'm a 4.0 GPA student. She's a college dropout. She couldn't do anything if it wasn't for the guy who was fucking her. She can't have a place to live without the guy that's fucking her. I'm sorry. I'm about to fucking say it, okay? I will tell you guys, she only got married because she needed a place to live. That's it. Like, you gotta be kind of fucked up to think that's gonna solve your issues. But just because you fuck over your own life does not mean you get to fuck with me. And yes, I am fucking more ex successful than her. Yes, I'm more popular than her. Yes, I have more fucking friends than her in real life. No, I don't need Facebook for my friends. But you know what the biggest issue with my ex-friend is? She will always be jealous of me. 
always. I'm skinnier than her. I'm prettier than her. I'm smarter than her. I can do everything she can do. And the best part is, my dad likes me. My mama likes me. My family likes me. But just because she posts one shit video from last year does not mean anything. That does not mean my family fucking hates me. And yes, I'm getting a fucking lawyer and I'm suing her fucking ass. That's fucking harassment. That is harassment. The cops have told her to leave me alone. The Michigan City Police Department has gone to her house and they have told her to leave me alone. And she has not left me alone. She claims that she's the victim of assault and bullying and stalking. Who runs the Facebook page Sailor Moon will never beat Redding Peach, huh? My ex-friend does. Who runs that fucking Reaper account? My ex-friend does. You know how fucked up you gotta be to think that messing with me and my family is not gonna get you in trouble? So yeah, I have dealt with this for fucking, for two, two and a half years, going on three years. It's one thing to say, oh, Tracy is a bad person, but when you post shit like that and... You claim that my family hates me because of one video. That makes you sound jealous. That makes you sound petty. That makes you sound like you want to be me. Why? Because my mom and dad love me? Because my aunts and uncles love me? Why does anyone even support this slut? Why do they even support this skank? And yes, she's a fucking slut. And yes, I'm going to fucking slut shame her. Because she needs to be. I have asked so many people to make her stop harassing me. And no one will help me. So I am exposing her. She is a racist rapist. That is what she is. I'm sorry, but I'm not gonna... I'm done staying quiet. I'm done. This fucking book's coming out. She's gonna wish she was dead. She's gonna wish she had committed suicide. Why? Because all her fucking secrets are coming out. All the messages she ever sent me in the last ten years. I am done staying silent with her raping bullshit. I'm done. She bullied my mom. She harassed my family. And for the record, her sister deserved it happening. Yes, that should be really offensive. Because you don't abort a child and then fuck a guy just to get another one. What, having an abortion the first time wasn't enough? You had to fuck another guy to get another baby? Like, what the fuck, man? It's one thing to attack me on Facebook, but when you bully my family, I can't even... I can't even. Her fucking sister deserved that happening to her. For the record. She probably asked for it, too. I'm done staying silent. I'm done playing nice. Just because I had one fight with my mom last year does not mean she fucking hates me. You know what that makes you sound like? It makes you sound like you're jealous. Like you're envious of my success and my family. I can promise you something. My ex-friend's dad will never love her. Harassing me, abusing me, that does not make your daddy love you and your mommy still hates you. <laughs> My mom will never hate me like that. We had one fight last year. We fixed our issues. But publicizing an argument with my mom and rubbing it in my face, you know, here's something to rub in your face. You're still as much of a failure as you were in 2006. I'm sorry to say that. You're right, I'm not. I'm not fucking sorry for saying that. I'm just, I'm just so tired of this bullshit. I'm tired of people saying Tracy is a bully and a bad person. I didn't do anything to this bitch. I didn't steal from her. I didn't scam her. I didn't do anything. You ever find it ironic that she keeps claiming I'm this scammer and every time I expose her lies, she re fakes reports on my posts so people can't fucking see them. The blog is still up, by the way. <laughs> the truth is still there, by the way.
If I have to post it a million times, I will fucking post it a million times. This is getting out of hand. Like, it's one thing to bully me on social media because I have a bigger doll collection. Because my friends actually like me. Because my family actually likes me. Because my dad actually likes me. This is... Making a... Posting a video for something that was last year. To make me look like my family hates me. You sound fucking jealous. You sound petty and vindictive and you sound like you want to be me. I don't know, maybe it's because I'm bilingual and she just hates me. Or maybe it's the fact that I can actually speak two languages and she's just jealous. But I'm just done. I'm done being nice. I'm done staying quiet. Look forward for the uh, Coriander Bullet Expose story. And it's not going to leave anything out, by the way. I'm not hiding anything. All the messages, all the screenshots, they'll be in the book too. For anyone who claims I made it all up. And FYI, she still owes me fucking money. I commissioned her. I, I paid her to do an art piece that she never fucking did. I don't even think she ever started it. I paid her to do editing that she never ever did. I paid her to do editing three times and she never edited my books. I paid her to be a publisher. She just took my money and ran. She's not a fucking publisher. She's a scam. There. I said it. So anybody who supports Coriander Publishing, you are supporting a... A rapist, if nothing else. You want to talk about Tracy deserves this happening? <laughs> For fucking sakes. You know what? I don't deserve any of this. It's one thing to, to hate me because I have better doll collection, but... When you post shit like that and claim that my mama hates me. You know the truth is? Her mom and dad hate her. I talked to them. Her mom is so fucking ashamed of her. That she kicked her out of the house. And claimed that that was me that I got kicked out of the house. I never got kicked out of the house. I went away to school. I graduated high school with a 4.0 GPA. I'm in college. I'm not going to drop out like my rapist ex-friend. Or should I just call her a racist? I don't know. She claims that she went to junior college. She never even graduated. She went to college for like a month. I'm sorry. I'm guessing she doesn't want anybody to know that she's a failure. You can't really say you go to school when all you do is go to school for 10 minutes and drop out. And for the record, you can't really go to junior college because my ex-friend never actually graduated high school. Homeschool or not. Yeah, I'm fucking exposing her ass. I'm just done. I'm done staying silent. 